In this video, we're going to talk about how to create a form to gather information for actors on your film or TV project. We're going to be using Google Forms, which is a free service from Google, similar to Google Docs. Once you're inside Google Forms, you're going to create a blank form, and then you're going to customize it for your project. I'm going to show you briefly um, the form that I've created over the years, um, so you can kind of get a picture of what I'm talking about. Uh, right now we have seven sections. We have a section for name, date of birth, email, cell, location. We have a section for travel, a section for their costume size, a section for their union information, their SAG ID, dietary restrictions, and then additional details. You can keep adding more sections, but these are kind of the basic sections that I've created. Now why do you need a form like this? Now sometimes when you're dealing with actors on a show, um, the casting department may give you all this information or they may give you limited information. Um, a form like this will allow you to get the information you need um, so that you can relay it to your costing department without them trying to track down the actor and, um, and gather that. Or maybe you're, the actor is flying in from out of town and you don't want to have to ask all these different questions and you want it to answer um, through the form. Um, the other reason you may want to create a form like this is you just have a lot of day players and you want to get a lot of information quickly without having to email or call um, and, and gather that information. You want it all one spot, one spreadsheet. Um, so this form is relatively easy to make. You can make it in a few minutes. Um, use these options to the right. You can add a question, import questions, title text, add an image, add video, add a section. And when you're adding a question, you have the option to show what kind of question you want. Is it short answer? Is it a checkbox? Is it multiple choice? Um, one of my favorite features in creating this form is when you come down, let's say here, are you working as local to insert city, whatever city they're working as a local to. Let's say they are working as a local, yes. Then it would just go to section three, wardrobe right here. Because if they are working as local, that means I don't need travel information on them, right? So if, I, if they say no, I'm having this conditional logic where I can do con continue to the next section where I can specify aisle, window, middle seat. Um, we can also add more questions in this travel section. The same thing goes for their union information. What is your union affiliate? Well, right here, I put if they're SAG, then I they will automatically go to input their SAG ID the next section. Where the if they're SAG eligible or non-union, it just skips that question altogether. Um, so once you've made all of your your questions and you've thought through all the information that you need, you go to responses up here, and then you're going to click these dots here, select response destination, and you can create a new spreadsheet or you can select existing spreadsheet. Maybe you already have an Excel document, Google Doc that you're collecting information, and all that data will show up on the spreadsheet. So we're going to just browse through this one last time. Um, but one thing to think about when you're making this form is once you have the form, you have the responses, you want to be able to send this information to the actor. So what I do is I come up here to send, and you're going to take this little link here. We're going to shorten the URL, make it a little shorter, or copy it. And then you, what you can do is just send an email to you know, the five cast or the hundred cast, however many casts you have, and say, hey, can you fill this out real quick? It'll help us to um, gather needed information on you.